All right, so before we get into today's video, I should point out that there are spoilers. So if you don't want to know what's coming out in upcoming events, you probably shouldn't watch. Also, big shout out to this guy for letting me know about it. I was going to try to say your name, but I'm afraid I would butcher it. But yeah, big shout out to this guy for letting us know about it. All right, so for those who don't know, if you go to Storm Shield 1, and I'll leave a link to it in the description, you'll notice that they added some new ranged weapons, as well as new traps and new abilities. So I'm going to go ahead and go through each of these and point out the ones that are new. And first, I want to start off with the traps. All right, so on the trap section, you'll notice that there's retractable floor spikes, ceiling electric field, ceiling zapper, ceiling drop trap, gas trap. Uh, the first one that's new is this one that's called Vendor Tech Goop. It looks like it has uh, the retractable floor spikes as a placeholder, but it's called Goop. So that's one new trap I believe is going to be added to save the world. There's also another one called Retractable Ceiling Spikes, which I believe are just like the floor spikes, except they're going to be on the ceiling. Another new one is this one that's called Flame Grill Floor Trap. And I'm assuming that's going to like burn the husk because it's a flame grill floor trap. Really looking forward to trying that one out. They also got the freeze traps, healing pads, speed boost, which I've already gone over in a previous video. I believe that's the same thing. There's also gonna be a rail trap turret, which is another one I'm really looking forward to trying out. Let me know what y'all think about that rail trap turret. Uh, I'm not sure what this is, wall trap armor. I'm not sure what that is. See wall darts, wall dynamos. And there's also another one called Wall Trap Heavy Metal. Again, I'm not sure what that is at the moment. We got some wall launchers, wall lights, wall trap shield, which could also be another new one. There's also going to be retractable wall spikes. So not only can you get them on the floor and the ceiling, but you can also put them on the wall like you do in Battle Royale. And technically they could be Battle Royale's wall spikes, but this is in the PVE section of this website. so. They could come to PVE as well. But yeah, that's pretty much it when it comes to the new traps. Again, let me know what y'all think about that turret. Let me know what you think about the flame grill floor trap as well as the vendor tech goop. Let me know what you think about those new traps in the comments below. Next up, let's look at the ranged weapons. And I'm only going to point out the ones that I believe are new. Uh, this could be one of the new weapons. I've never heard of a weapon called Neon Assault Rifle. Uh, there's also an Easter Grenade Launcher, which I'm assuming is going to be one of the new weapons we're going to get during the Easter event. So yeah, we will be getting a new Grenade Launcher. Uh, let's see if anything else is new over here. Neon Pistol. Again, there's no picture of it, so that could be one of the new weapons. And I believe that's it when it comes to the ranged weapons. We got a Neon Assault Rifle, a Neon Pistol, as well as an Easter Grenade Launcher. Again, I'll leave a link to it in the description if you want to go check them out. Uh, next up, we're going to check out the melee weapons. And I haven't actually checked these out yet, so I don't know uh, what new weapons are going to be showing up here. Now, I don't believe I saw any new melee weapons. I went ahead and scrolled through all of them, but I don't recall seeing any that I haven't seen before. So I didn't see any new melee weapons on the website. And last up, we're going to check abilities because I believe there's some new abilities as well. I'm not sure what this cart is. It says carts can ride on track. It looks like it has a teleporter gadget placeholder. So I'm not sure what that is. All right, so I wasn't sure what this APOBS is, so I went ahead and Googled it. And evidently it means anti-personnel obstacle breaching system. And I went ahead and YouTubed it just to see what it is exactly. And I'm going to go ahead and show y'all what this looks like. So yeah, I've never seen an ability in the game like that before, so I believe that's one of the new abilities. I believe this tech clip incendiary rounds is another new ability, and that's going to grant you 10 seconds of incendiary rounds. During this effect, ranged weapon shots cause targets to take stacking fire damage. Deals damage every 3 seconds for 12 seconds. Damage is based on damage dealt, costs 55 energy, so I believe that's another new ability. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. I'm not sure what this home base level scaler is at the moment. 
a cycle's home base level from one to five. So maybe we'll be able to redo our storm shield defenses. I don't know. It's what it looks like. Uh, there's also glow torches and these are going to light up your base. And as you see, they come in all different colors. You get green, orange, purple, white, yellow. And yeah, they light up your base. And I think that's going to help people's bases look really cool. Really looking forward to trying those out. Uh, let's see what else they get. Grapple hook. Oh my goodness. There's going to be a grapple hook in Fortnite, people. I can't believe it. There's actually going to be a grapple hook in Fortnite. Oh my goodness. Obviously, this picture is just a placeholder, but damn. Let me know what y'all think about the grapple hook. We're going to be able to like climb cliffs and mountains. Oh man. I can't believe it. We're actually getting a grapple hook. Okay, let's go ahead and see what else we got. Hold on. Uh, gravity sphere I believe that's gonna be another new ability or either a gadget uh, gravity sphere is one matter collector is another one and both of these might actually be like outlander abilities because they're sandwiched in between other outlander abilities so I believe those are outlanders I think the tech clip is a soldier ability because that's in between soldier abilities and this A-Pops is probably another soldier ability. So I think those are the new abilities. I still can't believe there's a grapple hook. That's crazy. Uh, let's see what else they got though. Uh, we already saw the gravity sphere and matter collector. There's also a plasma bomb. Hurls one single plasma explosion. I believe that's new. There's also a quick wall, which is going to place a quick wall. So evidently we can place walls without having to wait for them to be built. Uh, that sounds interesting. There's also a quick tower, auto build tower. What? It's gonna automatically build a tower? Is that right? Uh, there's already Roman candles in the game. I haven't gotten a weapon with that, but I don't believe that's new. Uh, there's also gonna be a seeker and this throws a heat seeking explosive. Wow, that's crazy. And there's also going to be a stamp tool and stamps pre-made building pieces. Wait, pre-made building? I don't understand what that pre-made building pieces is. Is that like having a blueprint for a specific build that you can already stamp down, I'm guessing? I'm not sure. That sounds crazy. But yeah, there's also a seeker and a stamp tool uh, and a sentry gun. Deploy a powerful tripod mounted sentry gun that automatically fires on any hostile targets that enter its line of fire ah uh, there's also so there's going to be a grapple hook a sentry gun we got a seeker a stamp tool a quick tower quick wall plasma bomb uh, we also got a couple new abilities let's see gravity sphere and matter collector or they may be yeah those are abilities i believe uh, we also got the grapple hook, which is crazy. I can't believe that. I'm looking forward to using that. We got glow torches, which is going to light up our bases and make them look badass. What else do we have? Uh, cycles home base level. Maybe we'll be able to go back and redo our storm shield defenses. I don't know. Uh, we also got the tech clip ability and the APOBS ability, as well as these cards. I'm not sure what the cards are. But yeah, guys, that sums it up for all of the abilities. Again, when it comes to traps, there's going to be a vendor tech goop, as well as a flame grill floor trap. And was there anything else when it comes to traps? I believe there was some other stuff. Hold on, let's see. The rail trap turret. Don't forget about that rail trap turret. Wall trap armor. Wall trap heavy metal. I'm not sure what those are at the moment. Wall trap shield. Um, I'm not sure what those are, but there's going to be a rail trap turret, vendor tech goop, and the flame grill floor trap. Again, I don't believe I saw any new melee weapons. Uh, if you see any new ones, let me know in the comments below, but I believe I've seen all of these before. And when it comes to ranged weapons, there's neon assault rifle and a neon pistol, which I believe are new weapons. And there's also the Easter Egg Grenade Launcher. And I believe that was all of the ranged weapons. 
But yeah guys, I know that was like a lot of new stuff in just one video, but I did want to give y'all a heads up so y'all know what to expect with some of these upcoming events. Let me know what you're most hyped about. The new traps, the new abilities, the new gadgets that they're showing on this website, which again, I'll leave a link to in the description. And again, big shout out to this guy for telling us about it. Anyways, let me know what you think about all this new stuff. I hope y'all enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.